Hi, my name's Dave, I'm one of the paramedics and it's my job to drive the ambulance to get you to the new hospital and on the way I'll point out some of the exciting things that we passed. Okay, before we can set off, we need to close the doors. This is what it will look like. Don't worry, one of the paramedics on the nursing team will still be with you in the back of the ambulance. So here we are in the back of the ambulance. This is where you'll be for your journey to the new hospital. You might hear some beeps and bangs. It can get a little bit noisy in here at times, but there'll be somebody with you all the time. There's somebody like me, a paramedic, or perhaps maybe even a nurse from the hospital. Okay, folks, you comfortable? Let's go. Let's wave goodbye to the sick kids and start our journey to the brand new hospital. Don't worry if you can't see out the window. You can see everything that we're passing in this video and you can also follow along on your map. Here we are in the Meadows. That's the big park just down the road from the old hospital. Okay, now in the distance you can see half our seat. Fun fact, according to an old Celtic story, the rock is a sleeping dragon. The dragon used to fly around the skies of Edinburgh and one day it ate so much that it went for a snooze. If you look really closely, you might see it snoring. Now we're passing the Commonwealth Pool. Fun fact, this pool made a splash at the 2014 Commonwealth Games and the 2018 European Championships. Just about now we should be passing Craig Miller Castle. This castle is fit for a queen. Mary Queen of Scots often stayed here in the 1500s on her tours of Scotland. We are now at Little France, the location of the new Royal Hospital for Children and Young People. We will be pulling up outside very shortly. Well, that's us arrived. Welcome to the Royal Hospital for Children and Young People. Should we go inside? Okay, let's go inside. Follow me. 